We are live in Las Vegas, Nevada, getting set to wrap up the first weekend of Slam Ball. This is day three of action right off the strip here in Las Vegas. We are inside Cox Pavilion on the campus of UNLV. The fans are in the building. They are getting set for the first game of day three. The Buzzsaw taking on the Griffins. What's up, everybody? Oh, we are Little having so gigging. much fun in the booth. Let me introduce my guys, 11-year NBA vet, three-time NBA slam dunk scoring champ. He's Nate Robinson. And then we have a scoring champ of our own former slam ball legend, LaMonica Garrett in the house, former mob member. He might be wearing a mob shirt underneath. Could be. Could, could be. be. Could be. <laughs> I'm John Schriffen. All right, guys, day three of action. It gets getting better and better. LaMonica, what were your thoughts on the first two days of Slam Ball? I think the first thing that jumps out at you is Ty McGee. I mean, he set the all-time leading scorer in, in a game for, for Slam Ball, and here he is right here. We knew this new league, this new this new season of slam ball, these new players, they were gonna push the game forward further than we did back in the day. And they did just that in the opening weekend, and I'm excited to see what else is coming from it. Nate, what was impressive about McGee, he did it from everywhere on the floor. Yeah, man, he figured out how to you know how to score. He's taking advantage of, take full advantage of uh, you know, being the man of his team that's gonna, you know, lead them to victory because I know they got uh, one of their best players is out. So, you know, he, he came in, you know, played well, 43 points. He had like 26 of them at halftime. Uh, yeah. He just really, you know, put the ball in the basket. Also had seven loose ball recoveries, a single game slam ball scoring record, 43 points. But that wasn't the only fireworks we had in the game. Take a look at what happened yesterday. This was the second quarter. As McGee went up for a jam, took a hard foul, and he didn't like it, Nate. I didn't see no foul right there, honestly, yeah. man. I just seen all ball. Yeah, they was chippy. They said that these two got no fight before. So yeah, they kind of, you know, they kind of, you got, you know, male testosterone going on in the games like this. You know, you gotta, you know, you gotta let it out. And that's what they did, man. It was it was so much action. The coaches got involved. I loved it. Coaches, yeah. both head coaches <laughs> got ejected. And at that point in the game, it was the second quarter. Ozone had the lead. But LaMonica, after the coaches got ejected, it was the Wrath who kept their composure, and they actually won the game. And that's why they won the game, because they committed less penalties. And there was one series down here where the Ozone gave up four or five penalties. And that was like nine or ten yeah. points on one series, and that was that was the difference in the game. All right, so where do we find all these incredible athletes to play in slam ball? Where the top players were invited here to Vegas, and then the coaches held a draft to pick their team. Check it out. Slam ball draft. Brightest talent we've ever had in the sport. Let's get to the first pick. The lot of select. Six foot five. Bryce Murray. Special day, special day to be here. The AP, the Griff Select, Justin Holmes. Yeah. All right, let's get set up for tonight. Between our first matchup, we got the Buzzsaw and the Griffs taking the floor. For the Buzzsaw, they are one of two undefeated teams remaining, and they are led by Ralph Bellamy. Nate, he has been a problem so far. Man, nobody is stopping him at the rim, and he attacks it violently. He gets after it. If his teammates finds him, he just finds a way to put the ball in the basket, and I love it. Look at him on the windmill coming at it. Stoppers not even jumping, staring at the camera. <laughs> hey, look at the numbers for Bellamy. In two games, he's got a total of 43 points. He's perfect on the faceoffs. But will the Griffs hand the buzzsaw their first loss of the season? For the Griffins, they are led by Justin Holmes, LaMonica. Yeah, he's a football guy. He's one of the players I've been watching. He's a thumper. 
And one thing about him, he likes to hit. Ah, I love it. And when he dunks, he does muscle dunks. He comes <laughs> in and puts both chest and, and hands in the rim. Like, he's a, he's a big dude. Yeah. Man, yeah, he's, he's a thumper. He just stopped that, that, that face off with a hip check. He didn't even have to block it. 14 points for the grips in their one game. Face-offs, he is perfect. It is going to be a banger. Buzzsaw taking on the Griffs. The lights are out, which means we are getting set for the opening throwdown. Let's take a listen to the introductions, the starting four for the Buzzsaw. Ad Handler from Toledo, Ohio. Number 12. Devontae Pratt and the coaches for the bus stop are Hernando Planis Jr. and Sandy Fletcher. Fans, make some noise for the bus stop. Now, please help me welcome the starting lineup for the Griffins. At Gunner from Roseville, California, number zero, Justin Holmes. At Stopper from Ontario, New York, number 18, Connor Hollenbeck. At Gunner from Fontana, California, number 13, Adam Stanford. At Handler from Danville, Virginia, number three, Tayshaun Jones. And the coaches for the Griffins are Jelani Janice, and Rodney Bond. Bears make some noise for the Griffin. We are getting set for the opening throwdown. Hit coach for the Griffins, Jelani Janice. They're looking for their first win of the season. They lost a tough one on opening night. And head coach for the Buzzsaw is Hernando Planels. He is now coaching for the second generation here in Slam Ball. He was around for the first iteration 15 years ago. And he's back again for his 2-0 Buzzsaw. Now here's the format for tonight. We'll have two games. The winner of both of those games will face off in the main event later tonight. Now the main event is important because each main event you win, you stack it, and they'll be added up at the end of the season, and that'll determine any tiebreakers in terms of playoff scenarios and playoff seating. We take a look at our starting lineups presented by Old Trapper for the Griffs. The Griffs coming out wearing the white. The Buzzsaw coming out wearing the gray. Let's get it started with a throwdown. So slam ball is a hybrid of basketball, football, hockey, and gymnastics. You see the boards around. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Not many spots that go out of bounds. You see the ball dish the court. Space, give me space. For the most Got part, you. the ball stays on the floor. Nate, easy, it is non-stop action out here. Non-stop action. They sub like hockey subs. They hit like hockey players and football players. It's non-stop action, baby. So inadvertent whistle to start the game. And we will reset. We play five minute quarters here in Slam Ball. Running clock. The only time the clock will stop outside of the fourth quarter will be for a face off. A face off is in lieu of a free throw shot. We don't shoot free throws in Slam Ball. We're different here. Something's telling me this is going to be a physical game. I feel something's in the air right now. First throwdown. Goes to Malik okay. Abdul Hawk, the yeah, six seven gunner from Seattle. 206 in the building. So well, they are already pushing each other. Here's your Seattle guy. Yeah. I talked to Abdul Hawk before Face the game and he said he had something for you, Nate. And I hope so, yeah, man. Represent Seattle. He represents that he represents Seattle. He represents that 84 like Randy Moss yeah. out here. <laughs> yeah. Got the gloves got the on gloves, and everything. Yeah, got the gloves on and everything. Football player. All right, here we go. First face-off of the game. The player who was fouled will get the ball. The guy who fouled him now has to play defense. Devontae Pratt's on D for the Budsaw. Justin Holmes, a former tight end for San Jose State. Here's the running start. Big leap. Yeah, he, hey, listen, he means Justin business. Holmes. I, yeah, he, he means business when he goes into the basket. All lunch pails. 
Make this guy, this side. I told you to keep an eye on this guy. It's all business, nothing not personal. When he jumps, he like looks at you like, I dare you to jump. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh I got to finish the dunk. That was Kayshawn Jones. He got up, though. Dunks count for three points. He didn't want that hit. He played hot potato on that oh, one. defense. Good D by Connor good defense. Hollenbeck. Hollenbeck is wearing the face mac as the stopper. He got hit in the face his first game on Friday. Uh-oh, muscle dunk. Here comes Holmes. Uh, muscle dunk. He doesn't yeah. shift the ball. Yeah. He's pretty nice with that. A four-year tight end at San Jose State. You know he likes that contact. He's a cowboy. Jump on Loves there. country music. Little John Party. Little Luke Combs. Three seconds. Three seconds. Three seconds. Well, they call three seconds on the island. That island is that middle pad. You can stand there. It's kind of like being in the paint on a basketball court, but you can't be there for more than three seconds. Here comes Holmes. Throws it back to himself. Once you leave the, the tramps, you got to throw it off the boards. Uh, here on that. I saw what he was doing, though. Pratt looking for a cutter. Oh, that's going to end bad. And and two yeah. players from the same team in the tramp is a violation. They got to communicate. Here you go. Here you go. Buzzsaw starting off a little choppy. They were mowing people down the other day. Oh, there's a hit. <laughs> oh, he don't care. Look. He just ate it. Oh, oh, he don't care about that push. Damn. He's he, he, he running right through that. Oh, good move. Good block. Connor. Hey, man. Yeah. They out we here doing it. We, gotta, man, we definitely got to get the blockers, man, some love. Easy. They're they doing a great job. That's Ooh, a four-point four. shot off the mark. Could have been a hand one. Deshaun Kelly, another Seattle guy. So, excuse me, that's Jamal uh, Barnes throwing it down for the buzzsaw. Oh, crossover. Mm. Pull up jumper. The jumper. Yeah. Oh, you can block that. Look. Goaltend those. Anything in the tramps, you're allowed to book for the goaltender. Scrum for the ball, won by the Griffs. But they're going to call a foul. Now, we only have one face-off per team per quarter. The second foul is an automatic two points because you're in the bonus. And the Griffs, excuse me, the buzzsaw will, will retain the ball. No, it's the Griffs, my bad. Here comes Jones entering the tramp. Windmill off the mark. The defense. You got the edge. No reset. No reset. Yeah, he, no reset. Reset. He, he has to go off the glass coming out the tramps. Uh, he has to throw the ball off the glass. He can't just come out. So the buzzsaw now coming the other way in the gray. Nice. Hollenbeck, another block as the stopper, man. He's getting their timing down pretty good. Yeah. Entering uh, into the bottom on. tramp. <laughs> Don't touch him yet. Them big boys got that popcorn down good. So a bounce violation. And under a minute to play here in this first quarter. Huh. Chaser. Gave it away. Buzzsaw, we're ready for that one. He dribbled, yep. Throwing bodies oh, around. <laughs> Jump shot from four point. Oh, yeah. and it's good. Keyshawn Jones. He's a handler. He was out here pregame practicing that shot. Oh, oh. 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 double cross. You got a little handles yeah, right there. Double cross, good pass. Got a punch there. Here comes Jones. Some he just violent. hit a four point shot. Now Something violent's shot. about to happen. Three. Let's go. He put on a show. If you notice how he landed, he just went limp and let his body go. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you don't fight it. Final seconds here in this first quarter. Hollenbeck, another block. And that's how it ends. He just protected that ball. rim. He gave up six points there. Yeah. Nice. What a quarter by the Griffs. Justin Holmes, the former tight end, throwing it down with the windmill. Mm, have some.
a slam ball. That last dunk, Kayshawn Jones. Nate, he is filling it up. Filling it up, man. Nobody's stopping him to the rim. He's showing us some good force. moves. Yeah, he's yeah. showing us some good moves. Being real aggressive. Oh, good defense right there. Throw the ball. Now go finish. There's Deshaun Kelly from Seattle. Oh, the buzzsaw get it back. The buzzsaw, one of two teams right now that are 2-0. The buzzsaw and the mob, the only undefeated teams left here in slam ball. That's two in the trim. Yeah. Yeah. But LaMonica, the Griffs, they've got the buzzsaw timing right now, and the buzzsaw look a little out of whack. Yeah, the Griffs got tired of hearing all this buzz, buzzsaw undefeated talk. They came out here ready to play. Easy. The home's out here playing like Don't Debo. You better tuck them chains <laughs> in. <laughs> tuck them in like red. Pass. Here comes Bellamy into the bottom. Tramp has to reset off the wall as he exits. Mm. Abdul hot. Oh, give me that. Give me those. He weighed too much. Yeah. <laughs> Stoppers are big, man. Yeah, yeah, shot clock are. winding down, and he did not get the shot off. Shot, shot clock, clock violation. Shot clock popcorn violation. be a little different when you're over 250. You're good. <laughs> Connor Hollenbach, he's another former football player on this Griffs. Played wide receiver in college and indoor football. He didn't touch it. We got him come off the ref. Yeah. We got him have a play, man. I don't mind seeing a face off, though. So this will be settled with a face off. Malik Abdul Haq at six foot seven out of Seattle. He'll have the ball. He was going up against Deshaun Kelly at six foot three, also out of Seattle, Nate. Man, this is Seattle, Seattle, Seattle crime right yeah. now. <laughs> yeah. The 206 boys. Kelly trying to beat the rim. Jump. Oh, oh, he missed oh. it. Oh. Hey, pull it tight. So I'm putting his helmet tight. So after a faceoff, the offensive team does keep possession of the ball. So the buzzsaw, even though they didn't score, they have the ball. They gave him the points because uh, he was floating. Floating uh, towards him on the okay. Three points. Yeah, okay. You got to go straight up. Three, two point pill. Three. Back up a little the bit. Buzzsaw back up, do back get up. the three for the dunk there. Down by Easy. nine Stand. here in the second Stand. quarter. It's home. I'm a bad yo dogs. No reset. No reset. Yeah. 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 Ooh, what's that? Go, no reset. <laughs> yeah, he came I out the and didn't, didn't pass the ball out. Man, how many turnovers already is that? Oh, they oh, going. Oh. Big boy against big boy. Ah, somebody better get back on D. No stopper back there. There you go. Reset. Buzzsaw trying uh. to get on track here on offense. Here comes Pratt. High off oh, the glass. Nice the floater no good, but Pratt gets his own board. Tie up. Yep. Tie up. Tie up. Tie up. Also plays. Also plays. They are already out there running. Holmes through the legs oh, to himself, but he traveled with it. You can't stand Play. on that black part. The only black part you can stand on is the middle pad. Every other pad is out of bounds. Gilligan's Island. Nope, give me those. Fast break, they got numbers. Oh, he's look, oh. Here come work. the Grinch, they got a lob. three on one. Up top to Holmes. Ah, they gotta work on that lob. Hit him. Got a little push. Too nice. Barnes off the glass. No, Can't no, get it back. No. He, almost, he almost killed himself on that backboard. Here comes Jones. Settles on the island. Yeah, too many yeah that was too many bounces. Go, bounce, 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 go. You no, can't no, no, bounce no. twice in the same tramp without releasing the ball. That's a travel. Man, the might score this pretty well. Yeah. Maybe oh, they, crossover. Mm. Yeah, that's, oh, a, penalty, that's a real penalty. foul. You gotta call. <laughs> you gotta call that one. Legal contact. Legal contact. Yeah, they already have a face over off. There. Man, yeah, I want to see points. a face off with him too. Mm. Two physical boys. Once you leave the floor, heading into the tramps, you can't be touched. That was a foul. They get two points. They're in the Pop. bonus. Get out. Look, he's so heavy. He's taking all the bounce. Get out. Connor's a savage back there. Abdul yeah. Hawk, that's from four. When you get tired of just getting stuffed at the rim, you just start taking them four. Loose ball. I would do that Holmes. so much more. So often I'll be taking four. Bring them out. And 
under a minute to play. We got a reach in foul on Abdul Haq. Face off! Face off! I hope this face is face off. off. <laughs> yes, it will be. Right, if Coming this is a face off, this is going to be 6 back. 7 something against just 6 3, power. 2 30 cow no, power. No, straight no, power. Abdul Haq is 6 Are 7 on, on defense. Middle. Justin Holmes, 6'3", 235. Yeah. We are here for this. I said all he does is listen to country music and, and wants to hit people. Here's your chance right here. Here comes Holmes, one-on-one -on -one with the face-off. Oh, oh, he still jammed in real life. He likes that with Mills. Yeah. He does it every time. Because it's like when you go up, you're protecting the ball yeah. away from him blocking it. Then by the time it's already look, uh, you're coming down, you're coming down with four. Mm. And then when Two you hands. wind it up like that, and you're a strong dude. You got that elbow leading. Nobody want to get away that elbow. In and out. So Monica, what was your patented move when you were going up to the rim? Oh! Seattle boy, Abdul Hawk finishes. Ooh. He took his bounce. That was nice. Man, we need some more hits like that. Man, we've been man, we've been thirsty for yeah. hits. <laughs> <laughs> we've been in the desert. We just got uh, some water. Hit him. Watch Ooh. out! Oh, just you about to take him out? One. Just tackle him. Nice, nice. Right, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Good job. Get your nice. hands. Jam there by Adam Stanford. Yeah. Oh, there yeah. Oh. I like to see it though. That, that's a good penalty. I like to see it. Yeah. Ain't no flags in this. There you go, Jones. Ain't no flags in this. Sometimes you got to set the tone. Because they're in the bonus, they get two points and they keep the ball. Final second here in the quarter. I'll take that foul every day of the week and yes. twice on Sunday. <laughs> Who saw this coming? The Man. Griffs with a 24-13 lead over the undefeated Buzzsaw right now. Yeah, they, they, they stand physical, man. It's been a great physical game. We are at the half here in Vegas. We'll come back for more Slam Ball after this. Back inside Cox Pavilion here on the campus of UNLV. Slam ball after 15 years is back here in Las Vegas. This is wrapping up the first weekend here in Slam ball after coming back alongside my guys, Nate Robinson, LaMonica Garrett, John Schriffen. The buzzsaw came in here 2 0, but the Griffs, they didn't care, Nate. They brought it to them in that man, first half. Straight fire, man. They're bringing <laughs> that, that passion. And that physicality, what we need, we're missing that. That's what we need. We need bigger hits. We need more hits. Forget the fouls and all that, man. Get after it. Taking some of the highlights from that first half. Justin Holmes, the big boy. La Monica, this is yeah. what we want. Yeah, I talked to Justin Holmes before the game. He said he has something for me, and uh, he's showing out. We got a whole lot for everybody. That was Stanford with the one-handed jam. Let's take a look at your first half stats presented by Circa Resorts. And the buzzsaw, just three for 15 from the floor. A lot of it has to do with the stopper, Colin Holland, Connor Hollenbach. Man, Griffin's though, hit the stopper that Griffin's got, he's protecting the basket, but what he's doing that's so great is he is popcorn and so many guys down there because he's so heavy, yeah. they can't get a good bounce on him. Yep. So every time they go in there, he, he, you know, he uses his weight advantage against the other players and it works tremendously. Yeah. Those are your first half stats presented by Circa Resorts. Download the Circa Sports app today. All right, if you're the buzzsaw, LaMonica, how do you regroup here in this third quarter? You got to sharpen up them blades. Uh, Coach, Hernando better, <laughs> Coach Hernando better be in there. You're going to get in their face and challenge their pride. Like 13 points. I think they have 13 points now. Is that yeah, it? That's yeah, it. That's, that's not that's not buzzsaw ball for a half. They got too many talented scorers to be putting up 13. They got to right. get more aggressive and go at it. Also defensively, the buzzsaw, they were second in the league coming into this game, only giving up 33 points per game. They've already given up 24 points. The Griffs are doing whatever they want on offense. Well, they yeah. have a couple fouls. That they had a couple points that they just got two points. But as yeah. long as they keep playing, I think they stay together, they'll be all right. Yeah, they're getting Justin home to death. They got to figure out a way to slow him down. And Bellamy's playing a great game, too. They got some players. 
Now, if you see all the young kids and the faces in the crowd having fun, it's because it is a party here in Vegas. If you're coming through to Vegas in the next month, head on over to slamballleague.com. You can get tickets. You can pick your favorite team, get some gear. Nice. I'm telling you, this is a party right off the Las Vegas Strip. And again, guys, shout out to the DJ. <laughs> he got yeah. in there popping. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so we start each half with a throwdown. And the buzzsaw in gray come away with it. Down here to start this third quarter. Abdul Hawk. There it is. Oh, yeah. two of the two. Man. That would have been an easy bucket. Easy bucket. And if I'm not mistaken, Connor is wearing a face guard. Correct. He got hit in the face in the first game on Friday. So Connor Holland. Uh, stop. Uh, attacking the rim. That's how you got to do it. Oh, you got hops. Raise the roof. I ain't seen that in a minute. Uh, <laughs> easy. Adam Stanford from Fontana, oh, California. Oh, oh, shoot it. Oh, he about to shoot it. Jelly. Yeah. Contact. He about contact. to shoot that. Face up. I let him go. Face jelly. up. 13 and 6. Uh, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> he had him wiggling. He's going that side. So the first face off here in the third quarter off the foul. Ralph Bellamy with the ball. And Adam Stanford's sport, sport, sport. on D. There we go. Bellamy with the face off. He didn't jump. He, he, he jumped weird. Close to, yeah. yeah, he jumped too close to the black to the middle uh, yeah. to the middle island. You gotta try to hit you that, get that X in the middle of the yeah. trap. You gotta you get, get that X. Over, you look real unathletic. <laughs> he was yeah, falling, footwork, he was falling yeah. into him. Look. Yeah. One he was like, oh man. Ready. Yeah, that footwork be, be a little oh. shiesty when you get too oh, far. Oh my in. god, it's so funny. LaMonica, describe these tramps, because this is not your average tramp in your backyard. No, these ain't your grandfather's tramps. These are some uh, some real Olympic grade tramps, and they got the spring, spring bed. And look, you tried to jump for the foul. Oh, don't give him Come that. Come on, tramps. man. You can't give, give him, him that. that. And they didn't. We okay, like good. That. That's yeah. what I'm talking about. Yeah. Come on. Thank you, ref. You should get a flopping penalty. Flopping? No, a fine. <laughs> don't stop doing it. Out here doing that. This ain't soccer. Here's Abdul Hawk. Kicks it to the outside. Bellamy enters the bottom tramp and will reset. Oh, good defense. Away. Oh, Connor is nice down there with that timing. There's the masked man, Hawk Connor Hollenbeck. <laughs> oh, Ooh. lost it's his the hats that come off. That'd be funny. Get your helmet. Get your helmet. Get your helmet. Hawk off the backboard. Ah. <laughs> oh. I love them diving around. They want it. They oh, want shoot it. it. Shoot the four. Gotta find it. The backboard. Uh, yeah. Nate, where, where would be your spot on the floor where you take some jump shots? My jump shots will be, for sure, tight corners. Tight, tight tight. For one, because it's hard to rebound from. And then I'm definitely taking it from the top of the key because if I shoot, I can see where you're it's ball, coming off ball. at, and I'm following my my, uh, space, my shot. Space, okay, space, So I get the rebound him. myself. Anything beyond the arc is a four-point shot. Oh, Anything stand. inside the arc from the wood is three. Shoot. And foul entering the tramp. Automatic two. They're in the bonus. Two more points. Yeah. Oh, he barely touched him. Too. I see why you're so mad. <laughs> I didn't touch him. But yeah. He barely oh, threw a lob to himself. Yeah. Ooh, that was nice. I'm surprised more players don't utilize that. That was Bellamy. Well, it's tough because you got that heavy, you got that heavy blocker down there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a three-pointer. Steps into a three off the mark of Stanford. Buzzsaw trying to build on a little momentum here in this third quarter. Yeah, let's see if they can keep this going. If they get a score here, they're in good shape. Here comes Howard. <laughs> Give me those. Oh, oh good hit. Bow. Stanford. Good hit. Yeah, two nice guys. hit. Look two at him. Yeah, he hyped. That's how you do it. How about Jamal Barnes who just laid him out? I played Los with Angeles. I played with his dad, and he was a thumper out here. <laughs> yeah, and he was an MMA guy. Oh, they called that a foul. Another two points. Yeah, they coming back. That's how you get. That's how you get back in the game. That's how you get back in the game. You got to keep your composure. Penalty points. Coach Jelani needs to pull his uh, his grips together and tell them to keep their heads in the game. release. You only get a timeout in the fourth quarter, so Watch, the coaches can't stop the clock just yet. Helmet, that is crazy. Easy. Ball on the floor, diving on it is Jordan Grant. Yeah. Here comes Holmes. Denied. Denied. Access denied. He's the number two overall. 
go, here we go, easy, easy, easy. And he's showing you why. Uh, access oh, denied. Do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. They, 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 they talking to each other. <laughs> Somebody put a hand over. on him. Oh, good pass. Here comes Pratt. Throws it up. Good pass. Good pass. Uh, good good pass. pass. They're yeah, right they back, back in the this game. game. The Griffs have only scored three points in this quarter. Can't get on that so island. Can't touch the Griffs need to bring Bellamy back in the game. Bellamy is a spark plug when, when the offense isn't really clicking. He hot potatoed that ball. Oh, good pass with the behind the back pass. Yeah. Two more points for Pratt because he threw it in. A dunk would have been three. Gotta catch that. Back in the game. Yeah. Back in the game, down two. Hey, easy, tie up, tie up, tie up. Let's bust ball. Big fella down there. Yeah, let's go. Touch with 12 seconds. 12 seconds. 10 seconds to play here in this third quarter. Buzzsaw can get the ball. I'm going for a four-pointer. Oh, oh, just no. an easy two points. You got it, man. Tied up. Tied up. Tied up at the quarter at the end of the third. They had about nine points in penalties in that quarter. Oh, they get three points? Yeah. That was the fourth. Yeah, so they was, oh, okay, yeah. That was the fourth Go up one. Way to get the lead. This Let's way. go. That was a good little quarter for them. The buzzsaw come all the way back and take a one-point lead. They hold the grips to just three points in the quarter. Yeah, that was nice. Yeah. Throw it up. Your teammate at 6'7", Abdul Haq, going to get it. And the buzzsaw with a one-point lead. Let's go to the fourth. Here we go, getting set for the start of the fourth quarter. Nate Robinson, Ramonica Garrett, John Schriffen on the call. Buzzsaw with a one-point lead. Now, here in the fourth quarter, both teams do get a timeout to stop the clock if they need it. No! Oh, another foul. Oh, it's just, uh, but it's a face-off, though, now. Can't go through this. Oh, face-off! It's a face-off face now. I'm not doing that. I know. Let's play, ref. Now, now. Let's go. Face-off. Two hands. Can't. Are you going side? So, Terrell Howard, next. who was fouled, will have the ball. You going to middle? Okay. Going yeah. up You're mad. It's, it's personal. You see it in his face? It's yeah. personal. Oh. Illegal, you can't your do that? Yeah, you can't take a start and stop no, again. Oh, you can't have Your ball still. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta go. Violation. Oh, my bad. This way, oh, yeah, yeah, you gotta Ooh, go. You can't hit. Yeah, you can't hit. the face-off. Come on, can't man. Face. We want to see face-off. You can't mess can't up a face-off. Face they caught another oh. foul. Well, so heavy just come on today, guys. What was the difference in the game back in the day, LaMonica, in terms of the physicality? I think it was a lot more physical. I think these players, they're going to get more physical once the, the, the season gets going. But a lot of the players back in the day, it was, you know, we were just looking out there to take people's heads off. You know why? You know why? Because referees were just excited as the fans watching the game. They weren't calling no fouls. <laughs> Letting them go. <laughs> Now, now, you know who else can talk about China. what it was like back in the day? Sean Jackson, a.k.a. Inches, Inches. What was it like getting thrown around and you no throwing hands, dudes around back in the no day? Hands, you know? Yeah, yeah. Me being a short, small guy, you know, that's what it was playing against football players because football players, they had their hands out where they could just, you know, take advantage of any little guy, but not me. You know, I, 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 I laid them out. Oh, I laid them out, but it was real brutal, though. Because that was so good because they didn't think I had that strength and that power to, to knock a big man down. Who was the fiercest player back in the day, LaMonica? Man, that's uh it depends what day you're watching. There was a lot of guys that really brought the wood. Inches, inches, what do you think? Who who was the dude who was like, uh uh, I don't want to get hit by him? You know who it is, the guy that's sitting right next to you. <laughs> <laughs> the machine, aka the Wolverine, okay. aka LLM, aka let's hit him in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when I was a kid watching, man, I, I, the hits were the best thing about slam ball. It wasn't even the dunk ons, it wasn't none of that. It was the hits because we were like, we were on our seats the whole time as kids watching it. Yeah. Just oh, oh, did you see that? And then we went play Little League football, and we're out here trying to do what we see in slam ball. <laughs> yeah, that was a big element to the game back then, and that was our our identity as the mob, and that's who Coach Kirsch drafted. Me, Chris Robbins, we set the tone early. It was one of those, uh, the guys barking before the game, you lay a shoulder into their chest, quiet as church mice all throughout the, the rest of them. That's Jamal Barnes, Jr. Played college 
coach basketball at Dixie State. Holmes. The kick out for the four-pointer from Jones. Too nice strong. Shot. Nice shot, though. Coming the other way is Howard. Into the bottom tramp. <laughs> He's so heavy. Look. <laughs> the Griff Call still has scored. Oh, who's the pass? Oh, wow. He's trying to find his stopper, but the reset. Shoot that stopper. There you go. Shoot that. Oh. Nobody's back. Nobody's back. Out of position. Here comes Stanford. Oh, and he made there him go. pay. Yeah, made him pay. There you go. So he gets the dunk for three points. The Griff's down by three. And another foul. Yep. That's two more points for the buzzsaw. Okay, who's coming in now? He makes substitutions on the fly, just like hockey. Don't extend. I'm liking all these tippy tap fouls. Yeah, they got to they're slowing the game down with that. Good defense, good hands. Shoot that. Shot clock coming. Bellamy from the island. Shot clock's winding down. It's at six. Oh, into the boards. We felt that one. Off the glass. And a violation shot clock winding down. Griffs down by five. They need to get busy here. Chaser. Oh, man, chaser. Oh. Too far. Yeah. Find that helmet. There you go. You there just got to You just got to disrupt him. Under a minute to play in the ball game. You notice he ain't dribbling. There you go. Howard gets Shoot it off. Shoot it. You can't let them get the rebound. Yeah, you can't go in there. Helmet, helmet, helmet. Offensive player Step can't dive into the tramps trying to get a loose ball. 39 seconds. This is a good game. So the Griffs use their we'll see, we'll see, we'll one and we'll only see. timeout here in this fourth quarter to stop the clock at 39.5. LaMonica, if you're the Griffs, what are you talking about to make back this five-point deficit? Right now, they got the ball. They got to get just get in, get the three, however way they can get it, and then start taking fouls. Yep. Now remember, here in this fourth quarter, something introduced called the break it and take it. If you're the team that's down, you can foul to force a face-off. If you stop the guy with the ball on the face-off, you will get the ball back. So the game is not over yet. 15 penalty points. 15. Mm. Come on. That's a lot. Thank the thanks, refs. You better thank the refs. Yeah. Just. The buzzsaw have 15 penalty points compared to the Griff's two trying to jump into the trance from the logo. Like, that's not a penalty. Yeah, facts. So 39.5 to play here in this ball game. Don't forget, we got another game coming up next. The Slashers taking on the mob, and the mob have looked unstoppable. They just ran through their first two opponents on Friday. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited to see them play. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Yeah, Coach Kirsch, I hope, gathers the guys up and tells them, like, hey, don't start, you know, reading our own fan mail. Let's get out there and play ball, business as usual. I mean, just look at the audience right now. The crowd, they're all wearing mob shirts. Yeah, I see mean, <laughs> you can see it. Yeah, red and black. It's, it's the pinstripes, it. man. It's the pinstripes. Pinstripes <laughs> and hard hats. Yeah. They're coming. All right, if you're the Griffs, this is your chance right here. Down by five. If you get a dunk, you down three, and you're right back in it. Oh, good spin move. Nice. Stanford. He's got a cutter. No reset. No reset. Now two up. No reset. To no yes. three seconds and a turnover. Wow. You got to start, start taking fouls. You got a foul here. You got a foul. Yeah. There it is. And that's who I want defending a face off if I'm, if I'm the Griffs. Penalty, three Here's the break and take it. Holmes will be on deep. No, it's a face-off. No, it's got to be a face-off. Fourth quarter. Ooh. Oh man. Penalty points. What happened? What's going they on? They changed the rule. They must have changed the rule. Now you got 20 seconds. Make it they gave him an automatic two points. They oh, gave him points, but points. it should be a, a yeah. break it or take it. That's the coach Jelani needs to. They, they need, need to tell they the refs. Need, they need to let them know. The this is fourth play. quarter. Crunch time. Should be a face-off. Penalty point, three points, three points. Even if he did jump, that's four points he just gave them. It just should be. Oh, this is over now, then. Game over. Here we go. Three points. Hold on, what's what's going on with these refs? They're not following the rules. Let's go. Make it or take it. Now 
now they now they realize, but so much time has already run and off the clock, points. and they added points. Time yes, and four so. points. Dang, man, messed up the whole game. Pratt, one on one. So because Holmes got the stop on the break and take it, the Griffs get the ball back. They should have subtracted yeah, those that, points that, off the board. That yeah. breaker to take it should have happened a long time ago with a lot more seconds left to go on the clock. So here's Stanford with the restart down by 11. Just take it to the hole, man. Just go straight up. Yeah. Easy. Don't touch them. Got to launch it now. Stanford for four. That's a good looking Ooh, stroke. Good shot. If I'm the Griffs. I feel a little, I'm feeling some kind of way right now about the refs. So that'll do it. The buzzsaw. We're down at the half, but they come back here in the second half and they remain undefeated. 3 0 on the season with a 41 30 win over the Griffs. Gotta hand it to head coach Hernando Planels, man. He made the adjustments at the half, yeah. and the buzzsaw looked like a completely different team out there. Yeah, yeah big time change. Uh oh, chain game. What I'm seeing early in this season is those points, those penalty points could be the, the difference in the game. It happened yesterday with the Ozone and the Rav, and today, it, you know, it was one possession where they had seven or eight points. Yeah, bit the grips in the butt. Yeah. Player of the game for the buzzsaw, Jamal Barnes Jr. He is standing by right now with inches. Hey guys, hey. Jamal Barnes, great game. Man. Appreciate it, appreciate it. How do you feel, man? Uh, I feel good. Uh, you know, we came off to a slow start, but, uh, you know, my team is full of some dogs, so I knew at, at halftime it wasn't nothing that we was down by 11. I knew that we was going to come out there and just still get the dub. Ready for next game? Yeah, we ready for next game. We're going to sit down and evaluate the mob and, and the slashes, and whoever wins, we're going to be ready for them. Nice. Congratulations, man. I appreciate it. Hey, Thank wait, you. wait, wait, inches. Shout out to my family. Shout out, Ma, I love you. Uh -oh. Wait, inches. What's the chain about? I got to get the story behind the chain. Barnes, they would like to know, what's the chain about? The chain? This is a loose ball rebounds. Whoever got the most gets okay, to wear it at the end of the That's game. Real. And you see me hustling I and diving like on the floor. I'm going to always give it 100% for my team because they got my back, so I got theirs. There yes, it is. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. Jamal Barnes Jr. rocking yeah. the loose ball chain. I so like the that. The hustle. The hustle man get the chain. Yeah, right. hustle and Hustle center. man. Yeah. So the buzzsaw get the win over the Griffs. They move on to the main event. Will they play the mob or the slashers? It's coming up next.